We're going to take that five yard star drill and modify it a little bit. So taking the same theme from our hip flip series to now adding a lot more change of direction to it, this drill is going to look way different. You always have to keep your hips down the tunnel. So if my tunnel is this way, I'm keeping my hips that way as best as I can. If I have to do a diagonal forward sprint, I'm okay varying off just a little bit. You'll see what I mean. So I'm going to start at the top right. I'm always going to retreat to the middle cone, get back to the cone I started, and then progress through the box with my hips down the tunnel. So if I'm starting at the top right, I'm drop step shuffling to the middle cone, getting my foot past the cone, sprinting back to it, getting around the cone into a shuffle, pushing to move, then I drop step open up, shuffle, sprint up, back pedal, sprint up, drop step shuffle, shuffle over the other cone, sprint up, drop step right back, sprint up to where we started, and we stop. So shuffle, sprint up, shuffle, drop step shuffle, sprint up, back pedal, sprint up, drop step back, shuffle, shuffle, sprint, drop step back, sprint up and then stop. Excellent. After you complete that, now we're gonna go into the crossover step. So same exact pattern, but now we're gonna go into a crossover step. So if I'm starting off, I first have to open up my hips, then I do that big crossover step and I'm there. At least I should be. The entire time, which is the second coaching caveat, as I need to keep my shoulders square down the tunnel. So I'm opening up, I open up, there's my crossover step, I sprint right back. Good. Shuffle, good. Open up, crossover step, good. Sprint right back, back pedal. Sprint up, crossover back, shuffle, sprint up, crossover right back, sprint up and stop. Good. The number one mistake that you will make during this exercise is not opening up your hips before going into that crossover step. So if Marty goes into that crossover step without opening up his hips, it's a very short step, it's not explosive, and he's probably off balance, as opposed to him opening up his hips and then doing that crossover step and then going right back. When you guys open up your hips, meaning just doing this thing, this opens up your femur. That gives your whole pelvis a path to move in as opposed to keeping that femur closed and you're just crossing over through the femur. You can't open up your hips at all when you keep that femur closed. Open up that toe, open up your hips, get that big crossover step, plant your feet, strong base, and you're right back to that cone. Good luck.